go, oh, I had a dream last night, and it was about the end of the world. And I know that's a little dissuading because, you know, theoretically, I guess we're pretty close to the end of the world if, you know, people do things stupid. But it started out in like a sort of wall type thing, you know, one of those wonderful TVs. And it was like, oh no, there's a meteor coming and it's going to hit the world and everything's going to explode. So I go around and, um, you know, try to look through the, the the wall and everything and try to get things. And usually people are freaking out and everything. But, uh, you know, they're being very, th they're like, oh, what do I need for a month? Uh, what do I need to get by for this month? Uh, and um, it, I, I was very surprised. Like, usually people are like freaking out. So... Um, I come across a friend and uh, we start, you know, doing things with the world together. And for some reason, the government did not like that. And they were like, no, you have to pay for everything still because, you know, that's the way it is and fear and blood and soul. But um, me and my friend um, go around and uh, we try to find places to survive and like lines where people are like being compassionate enough to, you know, be like, yeah, hey, you need some food? We, we've got some food. Yeah, we got 30 days, let's let's get this down. And um, eventually it turned sexy because we came back to my apartment in the middle of a mall, mind you, and um, started boinking like a, a lot. And it was quite, quite great because, um, yeah. Anyway, loves hugs and uh, don't let that hurt you in any way, shape or form. I'm not worried about it. Um, I mean, a little bit worried about it, but, you know, I've got to have faith that nobody wants to just destroy everything. Anyway, love you!